Bye guys. Love you. Bye honey. Bye biggie. Be good, okay? I'll be home soon. Good morning everybody. It is, what's the day? I don't even know anymore. It's a Wednesday. I'm just heading off to work. I'm starting at two o'clock and working till six. I also have a work meeting, so I'll be home a little bit later, but that's just a really sad for the doggies because no one will be home with them today because Hal's gone out for like an adventure. I think he's flying drones or something with Jamie. So that should be interesting. I'm excited to see the footage that they do get. But for now, time to head to work. I hope you guys are having a really, really good day. Just want to say thank you again for all the support this year. My overall how to style video is now out. So make sure you go watch that if you haven't already. Lols, look at my parking. I'm literally so close to the edge over here because... I don't want these cars to hit me, but I don't know if this is legal, so I think I might have to fix it. So we've been working out at home a little bit and like I've been exercising and I never ever ever exercise. So now my legs are so sore, like I can barely walk when I wake up in the morning, they're just aching. I think that means I need to exercise more. But at the moment, it's just really, really bad. And when I saw those stairs, it was not fun at all. Good evening, everybody. I'm finally home. I've actually been home for about half an hour. I'm not gonna lie. I've spent this time cleaning up the dog's mess. So as you guys know, we've had to leave them locked in the house, which means they can't go outside, they can't go toilet or any of that. So they honestly, they peed on the ground they someone did a little little poop and unfortunately one of the babies was sick so they did throw up on their little bed that was here so i ended up having to throw that away which is super annoying but i mean it's more annoying that they can't just go outside when they want they're confined in this house and that's what's happened they're sick in the house they have to go toilet I don't mind cleaning it up or whatever, like it happens, it happens. But just I feel bad for them that they can't just be outside doing that. And like they, and I know that they feel bad because I'm assuming Honey was the one that threw up because when she looked at me when I was cleaning it, she was so scared and she was just sitting outside like feeling so bad. I could just see it in her eyes. For some reason, we can tell who's done what because you can just see how guilty they are in their faces and they honestly can't help it so it just is so i'm gonna say it for like the fourth 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 time it's so annoying and i hate our neighbors so much and she's probably written in her logbook today that they've barked so many times but what can you do? Tonight I'm gonna make like a cool little pasta salad that I saw on Pinterest. I think I've tried to make it once before, but I can't remember. It's a little bit healthy and hopefully it turns out well. Enough rambling for me. I've been going on for two minutes now. So I'll speak to you guys after I make dinner. So this is my dinner tonight. I just found this like oven baked fish in the freezer. It's pretty good actually. And here's the pasta that I made. So there's spinach, there's pesto pasta and some salmon in there. I didn't record making it just because I wasn't sure what I was doing. But if it tastes good, I'm going to make it next time. And now I'm just watching some Bart and Geo vlogs. I don't know why, but I really, really like watching their vlogs. It's not as creative as like Casey Neistat and stuff, but they talk a lot more and you kind of just really know who they are as people and stuff. That's probably why a lot of the times I just vlog and I just talk to you guys because I like watching them. And so I kind of hope that you like the same as well and you want to know more about us and what we do day to day and our thoughts and all that but anyways gonna eat now so bye <sighs> good morning guys well my hair is like crazy right now it is finally a friday tonight we are playing both at i love rmb and i'm pretty sure how we'll also be playing at chase i'm not a hundred percent sure but i think think that we do have a special guest but it hasn't been confirmed yet 
until I think later today or something so that will be exciting so today I think is gonna be a bit more chilled as yesterday we had an adventure day and we spent the whole day out and stuff so we just got to get a bit of work done and I need to look on seek and indeed for more jobs I think there was two that I wanted to apply for but I'm not 100% sure like I don't want to be applying for ones that I don't really really want to work at like, I just want to get one job and I want to really really love it like I don't want to be stuck at something that just meh because now that I have Connor like I'm still getting that extra bit of money so it's okay and I'm not too too stressed even talking to my friend at Country Road she's been saying like it's not what she thought it was and she could not do it for the rest of her life so that's a little bit worrying because Country Road was like my goals she's just not able to show like her creative side because it's gabby and she's a really really creative out there person hopefully something will come across soon but for now it's time to make some breakfast we got milk if you guys can see behind us this is our vlog from exactly one year ago and i just finished watching it it's so weird to think how much we've changed with our vlogging honestly one year ago it was horrible it was so cringy watching half of the stuff like why do we keep so much silence in it it just didn't make any sense and our b-roll was really really bad although we did try but it was so shaky and it made no sense so happy with how far we have come in just a year i can't even wait until next year this time to see from this vlog that you're watching how much it will have improved because i know that it's just going to keep getting better and better but anyways it's time to edit the sunday fun day challenge i think by the time you're watching it it should be up i hope you guys enjoy it quick lunch is served so i just made some mee goreng right here and there is some egg inside this is like the egg right here it's really really good i cooked a little bit too much but i'm making fried rice so i can use this later on so the other day whilst we were at Kmart, i brought this right here it's a schwarz cough silver pastel color it looks really really good on the box and supposedly it should make my hair like a nice silver gray color but I'm not sure if it's going to work because my hair is actually purple at the moment. It's not blonde like the box says so right here. I'm going to try it out though. I've got two boxes because my hair is really, really long. And let's see if it works. Just got finished putting all of the hair dye in. Honestly, two was not enough. I reckon I need at least three or four, but it looks really, really dark. And I don't think I covered much, don't you reckon? It looks super dark. It looks like a, that brown color that you wanted to have your hair. Mm. Cause we're watching our old vlog and this looks, this looks like the same color that my hair was. I don't know. We'll see how it turns out. It might wash out lighter when I wash my hair, but I'm going to let that sit for about 15 minutes and then I'll rinse it out. My hair is done now. It's still wet, but I actually really like it. So I'm not sure if you can tell in the camera, but it's a lot more silvery and gray. It's literally really, really gray. There's no purple anymore. And if you look closely, you can't see like the yellowness as much like it's a little bit because I didn't have enough, but I think if I got another bottle, not another bottle, another two packets, I reckon this will go away and it's a lot more even now. Big thumbs up to that. I really like it. This is actually the color that my hair was meant to be when I first started trying to dye it and I'm finally with it, but yeah, not bad. It's about seven o'clock now, so it is time to make dinner. Honestly, I feel like we've been eating really, really late lately. We need to start eating a little bit earlier. I'm going to use ginger and I'm going to use some garlic. I need to crush that up really, really finely. Whoa, what the hell? Look at this. It's growing from the ginger. Damn, not sure if this is edible. Let me just like cut around it. Garlic and ginger all done. Next thing is Spam, hot and spicy of course. I used to not like this at all, 
but I've grown to kind of like it, especially when you fry it and make it really golden and nice. They're cut into nice little cubes and they're ready to be fried. So I've also got in here, as you can see, I've got just a mixture of corns, peas and carrots. They were just like frozen from the frozen section. Put them in a strainer, ran hot water through them and I think they're pretty good. Fried rice is cooked. The camera just died on me when I was putting in all the veggies though, but stirred it in and add the eggs and now it's good to go. Add a little bit of soy sauce, but then you can always top more soy sauce when it's in your bowl and when you're ready to eat it. 